Sage is going. Is he here? Yeah, he's still here. eating? Yeah. Are you still eating, buddy? Yeah. Are you still eating? Hi. Hi. Are you feeling better? Are you still loopy? So we got some sad news, guys. We have some sad news. We just came back from a specialist. Uh, Milo hasn't been doing very well last week or so. Hasn't been eating, has been throwing up again, had problem and diarrhea. Right, buddy? And uh, we decided, Alex recommended to take him and have a specialist do uh, ultrasound, right? Yes. Ultrasound. Mm -hmm. So today we went out to see the specialist. They did the ultrasound. And not a good news. A little buddy uh, has a big mess in his uh, colon. Which came back to be what? Lymphoma. Lymphoma, which is a form of cancer. Mm -hmm. um, which is pretty good size. Pretty good size, Vicky. Sad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's about the size of a battery, like this. So it's about four centimeters long and two centimeters wide, which is blocking, blocking his basically colon. That's why he has a hard time. That's why he has a... Has a hard time... Pooping. Um, there is... There is option that it's risky that we possibly could do the operation, but it's in his colon, so it's a risky operation. So, um, I mean, what are the pills that we're going to try to give him to make him feel better? What, um, what is it? I mean, we're going to give him some steroids, yeah, right? Yeah, so we'll give him some steroids um, to hopefully decrease the inflammation with the mass and... Oh. Hopefully make him feel better um, to decrease it in size so he can poop again. Um, it won't treat it completely, but it'll just keep him comfortable. Um, so usually cats with GI lymphoma have a median survival time of two years after diagnosis, but with the location that it's in, it's a lot worse of a prognosis just because he does have difficulty pooping. Um, so we'll try to keep him comfortable with some steroids and some antibiotics and see if that helps. But if he continues to decline, then we might have to consider euthanasia. Yeah, so uh, we'll feel him, you know, we we'll make him feel him as, as, as comfortable as we can. It's life. Hey, buddy. He's feeling a little bit better right now, I think, because he's still maybe a little bit loopy from yeah. Anastasia that he had. But, hi buddy. He actually ate quite a bit because he's been fasting the whole day before we went there. So he ate like a half a ball. <laughs> Look at him. Happy to be home. Happy to be home for sure, yeah? Happy to be home, buddy. Right? So this was a tough day for us. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. He was purring yesterday a lot.